Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If your dream is to become a data analyst or a data scientist, then cracking the SQL round is very important role in achieving your role. Myself, I'm Malu Prasad. I'm a mentor for data science and analytics. I can help you overcome this obstacle by explaining all the various questions asked in the top companies which are available at LeetCode platform. All my code solutions are there in my GitHub repository. The link for that is available in the chat description below. And I have also segregated the channel into different different playlists, namely easy, medium, and hard for the easy, medium, and hard questions which are categorized in the lead code platform, and uh, subscription based premium questions which are there in lead code as premium playlist questions. And I have also combined all the questions and I merged them into one single playlist, and I have ordered by the sequence number of their questions, and I call it as all SQL playlist. Let's see the question which we are trying to solve it today. It is type medium question number one seven one five count apples and oranges. Okay, they have given a table box which is consisting of box ID, chest ID, apple count, orange count. Similarly, chest ID which is consisting of uh, chest table which is consisting of chest ID extra extra which is there. We need to join them. Okay. Write an SQL query to count the number of apple and oranges in all boxes. If a box contains a chest, we should also include the number of apple and oranges it has. Okay, the query has to follow the resultant thing. Let's see it. Okay, let's take this input example. Now what they are asking is, this row represents apples in their box and this row represents oranges in the respective box and the respective chest. Additionally, some chests uh, contain some apples and oranges. We need to add them and we need to tell total apple count and total orange count. Okay. Instead of adding them, we can do one more thing. Okay. Let's calculate the sum of apples in box A. Sum of apple in box let's call this sum of apple sorry oranges in box b similarly let's call this sum of apple in c comma sum of oranges in c then what we can do we can combine these two things and can call apple count we can, can count these two things and we can do this orange count. How we can do this? Let's take a table which calculates the sum of these two things and one more table which calculates the these two things. Then we can do cross join and we can do the calculation. Let's write the code for that first of all. From boxes. Okay. Select select sum of or we can directly do this uh, what we call union all also sum of apple count as one something a let's call apple b or some apple only let's call it comma sum of orange count as orange count orange let's run it okay we got the apple and orange count from this table Let's similarly do the same thing for the second table. Select sum of apple count as apple, comma, sum of 
orange count as orange from from chess okay now let's join these two tables duplicate values also we want so we'll keep like this submit it okay it is just i think yeah just here you can see some of this table and some of uh, orange table also we got it now what is happening let's call this table as CTE with CTE as this entire table now from CTE select sum of apple as apple count comma sum of orange as orange count let's run it Okay, let's see where we are getting wrong okay then our logic won't be working here actually I think there is a caveat here if you see chest 6 has how many 5 and 6 can you see it so now what we need to do for this chest 6 we need to add both of them so we need to do what inner join of them sorry left to join uh, we did the wrong thing from boxes a and left to join what we need to do just b on a dot chest id equal to b dot chest id now select all it should be chess We have all the tables now. Okay, we have the apple count, orange count. Okay, we have nothing here. Okay, okay. I think this is what they are doing here. If you see. 6 and 15 apples after that 14 plus 20 15 plus 10 8 plus 19 so on so on so on so on okay then what we need to do we need to replace apple count plus orange count with zeros so let's just take uh, we don't want the other columns so let's call it as a dot apple count plus what we want b dot apple count it can be null also so i will take coalesc b dot apple count if it is null add as zero as apple count comma 
b dot apple count plus coalesc uh, this should be orange count plus coalesc this should be also a dot this should be b dot orange count whenever it is null it should be 0 okay, and we should call it as orange count okay now from this table what we want uh, apple count comma okay let's call this table some CTE with CTS now from CTE select sum of apple count as apple count comma sum of orange count as orange count count should be small c similarly here also small c now let's run it okay it got accepted now let's submit it okay our solution has been accepted by the platform thanks for watching my video if you want more in detailed explanations like this and also code code explanations just subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends who are preparing for data analyst or a data scientist interview one day you'll be cracking your interview with flying curves thank you